So, this morning, nine o'clock, about 200 people gathering outside Kings Cross train station in excitement for the new Arsenal shirt, the home shirt for next season. Um, I can think of better things to be doing at half eight, nine o'clock in the morning, <laughs> that's for sure. I wouldn't be standing outside the train station waiting for a kit that's already been leaked online. Um, anyway, the kit itself looks identical bar the collar and the little stripe of the 1516 um, strip. You know, a Puma and Arsenal trying to mug us off or something because, you know, it's, it's exactly the same in my opinion. Obviously, there's a slight couple of changes, but it's identical. You know, and, and people are, are now pre ordering this at £55 a pop. You know, Arsenal are quick to post out links to, to pre order it. Not quick to sign players, though, are they? You know, they, they've, they've got their season ticket renewal money. They've, they're going to get fuckloads of people ordering this shirt at £55 a pop. Yet, we're still going to be sat here at the end of the day without any signings other than the freebie Kalasanach. You know, at the end of the day, this happens year after year after year after year. It's boring, it's tired, and people still fall for it. You know, how many people are going to go and seriously order that shirt to date? I bet there is thousands of people already ordered it. And thousands that will still order it between now and the end of the day. It's, you know, the money-making machine at Arsenal is just unbelievable. They come out with all the spin, with the catalyst for change and all that bollocks. Yet, nothing's going to change. We all know that. Some of us ain't deluded enough to believe it will. When Arsenal prove they've changed, then I'll go and spend £55 on a shirt. Until then, I ain't buying that shirt. I ain't buying any shirt. The shirt I got last season, the last last home kit, that was a gift. I didn't pay for that. You know, at the end of the day, when Arsenal actually dip into their pockets, go and do what's required, i.e. sign up some top quality players in the positions that we need them, and not only that, sign up our two biggest names to new improved deals, then maybe I'll consider buying shirts. Until then, nah. I ain't, I ain't spending my money on that. That 55 quid can go on parking for the airport for when I go on holiday again. <laughs> but you know, it's just it's just unreal. I can't believe how many people are falling for it again and they're all gonna go out and buy it. It's just, I don't know what to say. I'm literally like lost for words. But there you go. What can we do? You know, at the end of the day, my stance is I ain't spending a penny on them. And I will refuse to spend any money on the football club until they actually go out and do what's required. There we go. Anyway, all enjoy the sun. Don't get burnt. Have a wonderful day. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Not far off 700 subscribers now. So yeah, overwhelmed with how quick I've, I've grown this channel up to that so far. So I appreciate all your love. Stick your comments down below and um, stick a like on the video. Have a great day.